Heather here from A Pyro Design, and today on Pick the Pink, I've got Melt Ink. Now this is Melt Ink's magenta filament. This is a PLA. Uh, they sell this in both 1.75 millimeter and 2.85 millimeter on their website, which I've included down below. Uh, this spool runs about $30, 30 US dollars. Um, and you may be able to find it other places. That's the best place I found to find it. And uh, it's pretty awesome pink, actually. I have got some awesome prints out of it. The color is amazing. It's a very vibrant, definitely, uh, you know, hot pink, uh, but, but beautiful nonetheless. So I'm gonna show you some amazing prints uh, that I printed with this. First, of course, gonna start off with my Maker Coin, which I printed on our Flash Forge Creator Pro at 195 degrees. And it's, it's awesome, it just looks great. It does my, my 3D Pink Mafia coin just so much justice. I just love it. Uh, the next thing I'm gonna show you close up here is another Chaos Cortex print. I know you saw some of Garrett's prints yesterday. This is a design he did. It's a print in place car. I printed this on our Zix Plus printer. Uh, and it did okay. It did pretty good. It not any fault of the filament. It broke when I went to take it off of the build plate, but I glued it back together and it's it's good as new. The next thing I have is a little flexi fish. This was printed on the Flash Forge Creator Pro also, and it's awesome. It print in place exactly as is, and the filament did great. It you know, definitely the sides are amazingly smooth. Even in each little like boning area, it turned out awesome. It's a little fun print, one of Ari's favorites. Uh, now, Travis's all-time favorite is the Venus box. Now this box we printed on the Zix. Uh, the filament is a little duller than printing on the, on the Flash Forge, which is interesting because normally we print on the Zix a little bit hotter and on most filaments it makes it a little bit shinier. But in this case, it's a little duller, but not a bad color by any means. Uh, it's just not as shiny as it was on the Flash Forge. So this you print in pieces and then put it together and then you can open and close it amazingly. So that's a pretty cool one. Uh, the next one I'm going to show you is a piggy bank. Now you saw this piggy bank in one of the previous episodes of Pick the Pink. This one's a little bit bigger. This one turned out a whole heck of a lot better. I printed this one on the Zix printer. Uh, no banding or anything like that. It's a little rough. I probably should have printed it quite a bit slower than I did. I printed this at 50 millimeters a second and I probably should have slowed it down a little bit since it's so intricate. Uh, but I still love it. Now i got to save those pennies and dimes for... Bay Area Maker Fair so we can make it and pay to stay there. Now the last thing I'm going to show you is an amazing shark! A shark attack! Now this was sent to me from Jerry over at Spectra 3D. He is definitely a supporter of the 3D Pink Mafia. He sent me some amazing stuff. Uh, some other prints as well and I have some in the, in the wings coming. I'm so excited. Now this was a model that was introduced to me by 3D Maker Noob and Jerry went ahead and printed it and it is very shiny in comparison to the prints that I got off of the Zix printer. Like the car was printed on the Zix and the Venus box. Um, the piggy bank is a little bit shinier. It's interesting. Uh, I'd have to go back and check the settings and the temperatures on those, but this is another awesome one. And this color is just amazing. I would have to say that this is probably one of my favorites that you're going to see all month. So that's it for this episode of Pick the Pink. Tune in tomorrow to see what pink I pick next.